At least two South Texas school districts have shifted to a four day school week this year, allowing for teachers to instruct additional classes or provide tutoring sessions for students that may need it. One byproduct and hope from this move is attracting and retaining more teachers. Three News reporter Simone Simpson joins us live in George West with this innovative decision and the district's taking advantage of the new school week. Simone, good morning. Good morning, Barbie, John Thomas. Yes, I'm inside George West High School's gym where they go big blue around here. And so a lot of school districts are probably in their Friday Eve mood, but for these next two districts, they are celebrating today as their Friday. And so Kingsville ISD and George West ISD are adopting their four day school week and teachers couldn't be happier about it. It not only gives our staff, but as well as our students, the much needed um, mental break that they sometimes need. Tanya Williams is the principal of Gillette Middle School in Kingsville ISD. She says Fridays now create possibilities that wouldn't have been possible for students before. But we're also offering um, physical innovation stations such as aerobics, um, yoga, um, things of that nature that we're not typically able to do during the traditional school day. Eighth grade U.S. history teacher Juan Marino is hoping students will use Fridays to work hard, then play hard. Uh, catch up on any work that they need so we can help them. If, if any of our students are behind, we're there to work with them a little bit more one-on-one. -on -one. That's saying something that during the time of a teacher shortage that we've been able to fill our vacancies fairly quickly. Superintendent of Kingsville ISD, Dr. Sissy Reynolds Perez says only having two vacancies amongst 200 teachers who are on board with the four day school week is a big deal. Many teachers have said, oh, OK, now I have time to actually go and participate with my students in a yoga class or maybe just with teachers in a yoga class, um, something to bring us back centered and focused on what we need to work on. Rejuvenate. Meanwhile, 72 miles away in George West ISD. I left a school district that I worked in for 25 years to come to George West. Kelly Wigington is a fourth grade science and social studies teacher at George West Elementary School. She was overjoyed when she heard the news of George West ISD adopting the four day school week. I value my time with my family. I've got three grandkids. I've got a new one on the way. For her, that Friday will give her the extra time she needs, family time. We want to assure our parents and staff that We've got you. We've got you taken care of for the school year. Dr. Roland Quesada is the superintendent of George West ISD. Parents will not have to worry about finding an extra babysitter to, to pay more out of their pocket. So we've been able to partner up with some good agencies that will help us. The Boys and Girls Club, along with the district's ACE program, will lend a hand for the four day school week. But without the help of teachers, none of this would be possible. I'm excited that we're actually 100% staffed in George West Independent School District. We have filled all our vacancies, and I couldn't tell you that last year at this time. In addition to some of the activities that you heard coming out of Kingsville ISD, the district also shared that they will have a grief group where students can come together, gather and talk about their feelings. That district, along with George West ISD, is really prioritizing the mental health of their students and teachers. John Thomas, Barbie, coming up later, I'll speak with the Boys and Girls Club here in George West ISD to see how will they keep students occupied on those Fridays. And that's a good question. I'll say a good task at hand. <laughs> Thank you so much. Yes, <laughs> we're going to need to know what is going to happen after oh, yeah. that, right? Um,